Hello, everybody. I'm here with Maurice Lamarche from Futurama. How are you doing today? Morbo is pleased to meet you, my friend. I will not destroy you today. <laughs> that sounds good. My first question is, why was Futurama canceled again? You know, I can't... I, I have no good answer for that. Uh, you know, we were doing okay in the ratings. I think we have a very strong fan base, but I think Comedy Central at, at that point in time just felt that, if, you know, they could make uh, less expensive programming that could fill the time slot. I don't know. I, 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 I'm sad it's gone. I won't count it down and out forever. I know Matt Groening would love to bring it back in some form or another. I don't know what and I don't know when. But usually when Matt Groening wants to do something, it gets done. So I haven't given up on the show completely, but that is not any kind of official word. Sorry? Yeah. All right. And to follow up on what Matt Gr Groening said... Uh, Groening. Groening. Very important. My bad. Yep. Matt, Matt Groening said, would you prefer like a, like a sort of series spin-off Futurama or a movie like how they did with Beast with a Billion Backs and Into the Wild Green Yonder? I just love doing those characters, so if he wants to bring it back as a puppet show, I'd be happy to do it. I mean, uh, the characters I get to play on the show are so wide and varied that uh, it's just it's, it's a tour de force as a cartoon actor to play. I, I, do, I have over uh, a dozen regular recurring characters, and I've done over 50 one-offs. So it's just a chance to stretch and, read and, and, and perform some of the best written comedy on television. <laughs> And lastly, from all the characters you did on Futurama, what was the best character you did the voice of, from your opinion? I really love Kiff Croker, because Kiff speaks to, all, to that part in all of us who's had a bad boss or been, you know, in a bad marriage or a bad relationship. And, you know, the Kiff sigh is just, it embodies all, all put upon us that every one of us feels. You know, when, when Kiff goes, <sighs> We all relate to. Ugh. So that is the, uh, and yet I love that I love that Kiff has this romantic side. You know that he's he's courted Amy. You know he started out as just kind of an eye rolling sidekick, and then he became you know a, a romantic character. So I love him. I love Calculon, the star of all my circuits, because he represents all of my narcissism rolled into one metal ball. All right. Well, thank you very much. Thank it you. was great meeting you. Thank you for having me on the show. Thank you.